In this video, we'll explain everything you need to know about modules. Welcome to our video about Walker modules. First, a quick note. We recently started our Walker build guide series. In our two first videos, we included a short section about Walker modules and how they work. However, based on your feedback, we have decided to create a separate and more in-depth module guide. So don't hesitate to give us feedback. As you can see, there are already quite a few modules, as all of these icons represent a unique module in game. So let's get going with the basics. As we are sure you know, modules provide walkers with unique perks. For instance, allow your walker to carry more weight, increase your cargo hold with additional slots, decrease the cooldown time when respawning on a walker. As those are just some of the many options you have, stay tuned for a separate video that will showcase them all in a lot more detail. There are currently 19 different modules in the game. By default, a walker comes with one module slot with space for one module. Each module slot has space for up to 10 modules. So in order to stack more modules per slot and to unlock further slots, you will have to build a higher level walker with quality materials. Furthermore though, it is possible to also unlock an additional 5 module levels with slots through your walker menu, accessed by pressing P followed by E. Don't forget that walkers you have already built will need to be upgraded with materials before any levels purchased with slots take effect. Walkers built after your purchase levels will have the additional module spaces unlocked once built. While currently capped at 5, it seems like the developers will allow us to buy further levels in the future. There is already a level 6 kind of on the menu, but it can't be purchased yet. Slotting a module is as easy as this. Simply drag the module from your inventory to a free module slot. Accept and it's all done. To upgrade, simply slot one or more modules of the same type as already stacked. Then simply accept to upgrade. As you can see here, if we try to remove a module, it will be destroyed. Similarly, if we try to replace an existing module with a different type, the already slotted modules will be destroyed. Each walker level or module level will unlock one additional space for a module, and every 10 levels will unlock an additional module slot. To show you an example, this walker can stack up to 102 modules. We can calculate it as follows. We have one default module space, then we have an additional 96 spaces thanks to our level 96 walker, and finally, five additional module spaces which we have purchased with floats. Let's talk about how you can obtain modules. Your first option is to obtain modules from chests and packages, which typically contain fragments. Usually, that will be lootable locations like the ones we're showing you on screen now. Beyond that, there might be modules available at your local trade post, which other nomads have put up for sale. Do consider checking several trade posts before buying and monitor prices over time to ensure that you don't pay too much. Finally, don't forget to check with friends or fellow clan members in case they want to trade. To round this off, a few last facts. Only modules of the same type can be stacked. Replacing or removing a module or module stack will destroy the currently slotted modules. Most modules have a max capacity limit beyond which they don't add any further value to your walker, so do be careful to use your module slots wisely. If you're interested in a showcase of all the modules and what they do, stay tuned for our module showcase video. As always, if you found this video useful, we really appreciate a like, and don't hesitate to subscribe and hit that bell for our future videos.